Brigitte here. So today I'm going to talk to you guys about why I have stopped using coconut oil specifically on my face when I was completely convinced the coconut oil was the best thing ever. So if you follow my blog or Instagram, you'd know that I am obsessed with coconut oil. I was using it on everything from my face to my body to my scalp to cooking with it to oil pulling with it to make my teeth whiter. I was obsessed. I loved coconut oil. It was doing wonders. Everything was amazing. But then I started to notice a few different things. So um, a number of months ago, I was breaking out like crazy. My skin was super oily. I had no idea why. I hadn't changed my diet. Um, I'm always experimenting with new things on my skin, but I hadn't really been doing that too much around that time. So things were just going crazy. I was breaking out a lot, a lot, like way more than ever before. I had no idea what was causing it. My skin was getting insanely oily. It was like a whole mess was happening. And so I was switching all of my beauty products, my hair products, my diet. I was changing everything except for coconut oil because I had had so much success with coconut oil that I was assuming that of course it can't be coconut oil. It has to be something else. Coconut oil had stayed strong for a long time, so much success that there was no possible way. Until I stopped using it for about a week just to try because I was out of ideas and I couldn't think of anything else that it could be. So I gave it a try. After a week, the oil started to diminish. My skin was looking a little bit better. And now it's been four months coconut oil free. My skin is completely back to normal. The oil has subsided, um, everything is great now. There was quite a bit of scarring from the uh, episode that happened. <laughs> and so it was looking really bad, but now it's coming back. It's gonna take a little while for some of the scarring to go away, but I'm way happier now. And because of this, I would never use coconut oil on my skin again. I know that your skin always goes through waves and it's constantly changing, so if you've been using coconut oil for a while in your beauty routine, you've been convinced it's working and it's still doing wonders, then completely by all means keep using it. But if you're experiencing the same thing as me, your skin is getting quite a bit, uh, quite a bit more oily and you're continuously breaking out a lot and you're just wondering why, just try cutting out the coconut oil, seeing if it works. Um, and also, I'm gonna give you at the end of this video a number of products that I use instead now that have done really, really great things for my skin. I do not use coconut oil on my body anymore because before, the only product that I was using was coconut oil. And everything was great, it was sinking into my skin, I love that it was a natural source that I was putting on my body, until I started to get a lot of dry patches on my arms and my legs, and I couldn't figure out why, it was kind of, it wasn't eczema-like, but it was just like very, just very dry and kind of rough and wasn't normal or nice. And so the only thing that I was putting on was coconut oil. But I had been using that for so long, once again, that I was convinced that it wasn't that. So I was changing up my shampoo and conditioner and soap as well. After changing those a number of times and nothing was happening, I cut out the coconut oil and after a month or so, my skin was back to normal. So another little side effect of coconut oil, why I wouldn't use it on my skin. I was doing a number of hair masks with coconut oil. Um, it was great, my hair was nice and shiny, like really shiny, any damages, and coconut oil was repairing it until I noticed that my scalp was getting really, um, really dry and really flaky and itchy and I just, I was again thinking that it was the shampoo or conditioner because I'm always changing them up and it wasn't, again, it was the coconut oil. So coconut oil I no longer put on my head, on my body, or definitely not on my face. <laughs> So instead of these though, but also I still do cook with coconut oil. It's really, really great to bake with for different uh, vegan treats if you make them or also if you use it for oil pulling. So to whiten your teeth in a natural way, it's really, really great for that. So I'm gonna do a video next on oil pulling with coconut oil. So if you're like me, you've had a bad skin experience from coconut oil, you have all this coconut oil left and you're wondering what to do with it, well, you can use it for oil pulling and I guarantee you That'll work wonders. You won't break out. It's inside of your mouth. <laughs> You're fine. Okay, so what I use instead now for my skin. First, I picked up Juicy Bamboo Gentle Facial Cleansing Oil Cloths. These are amazing. They smell really, really good. 
They are natural, they are alcohol free, synthetic fragrance free, paraben free, biodegradable, and sulfate free. And also really easy to travel with because, well, they have the cutest packaging ever. But when you take out the container here, a little plastic container where everything sits in, keeps them all hydrated for when you for when you're ready to use them. And also it's a good size that can fit into your purse. So these are amazing. By the way, I'll put all of these in the comment section below, and this is not sponsored in any way. These are the miracle products that I found right after coconut oil that have uh, rejuvenated my skin and really, really helped to clear it up. So secondly, there's Selkin Tea Tree Oil Wipes. So these are really great. The tea tree oil mixed with, mixed with the vitamin D has helped my skin immensely, uh, eliminating basically all of the oil and a ton of the breakouts. It's really nice, it smells nice as well. They're nice thick cloths. I've had a lot of, lot of success with this one. Except for over the last two weeks, I ran out and I've not had time to get this one. So I was searching for another product. I didn't have time to get the Juicy Bamboo one either. So I thought I'd try something new. So I have had experience with the Honest Company in the past and I bought one of their products, I really, really liked it. I was in Chopper's Drug Mart, so I picked up their three-in-one facial cleansing cloths, and I really like them. They're really large in size. They're thin towelettes where you can use on one side, fully take off your makeup, um, your eye makeup, everything. They're big enough where you can basically take off all the makeup on your face just on one side, and then usually I flip it around when I'm fresh-faced and um, just do another quick cleanse. And they have a really mild scent, which is nice as well. And so after cleansing and taking off all my makeup, what I use is the Honest Company Face and Body Moisturizing Lotion. Just like coconut oil, you can put it on your face and body, and it's portable, easy to use, great for traveling as well. So I would highly recommend this. It's not oily when you put it on at all. It's really light, it sinks into your skin, probably within like three minutes. So it's nice as opposed to coconut oil, which would take a long period of time. So I kind of usually put it all over my body and walk around for a little while, let it soak in. This is almost instantaneous. It's really nice and light and it's fragrance free. So you can um, lay it on your perfume or any other scents and you won't be overpowered by your body or uh, facial, facial moisturizer scent. So it's really nice, it's plant-based, hypoallergenic, ultra-pure, I absolutely love it. So as of right now, I'm using these three cleansing cloth brands and this face and body lotion, and I'm definitely going to experiment with others as well, and I'll keep you guys updated what I find, but so far, I really like these, and I would highly recommend them. So yeah, those are the products that I've switched to, and the reasoning as to why I'm not using coconut oil on my face scalp or body anymore so I'm gonna do an oil pulling video for you guys next so you can see how you, use, how you can use your coconut oil if you have any left and yeah so thank you guys so much I hope you like this video if you do please like share and subscribe thank you guys so much bye